Are you having problems with transaction failed on your Gcash app and you want to be able to fix this? Well, then this video is going to be perfect for you because actually me myself, I had the exact same problem before and I'm going to show you how I was able to fix it. So basically what I did firstly was that I closed my Gcash app and instead I went into the settings app on my phone. So just go into your settings app and in here we're just going to scroll down and then we're going to click where it says general. So click on general. And as you can see, it should now take you to this page, which is great. So now what you're going to do on this page is to just scroll down a little bit and then you're going to click where it says storage. So click on storage. And as you can see, it should now take you here. So on this page, you're just going to scroll up in here until you can see on the top where it says search. So click on the search bar here, just search for Gcash and click on the app. And then you're just going to simply click on offload app. And once again, click on offload app in here. Then click on the blue button here once again. And basically I did this myself and I just waited for my Gcash app to automatically update to the absolute latest version. Because this is what will happen basically where you, you are going to force your Gcash to update to the absolute latest version. So wait for it to finish, go back into the app and try once again. And hopefully now it's working for you as well.